All right, what is up, you guys, and welcome to what could very much be a very, very dangerous game. Gliscor comes in, then so be it. I don't believe I can gauge that more at all, but hopefully I can do something about it. I do have mods that can keep it like away, but that's about it. Let's see. Leads off with Gliscor. That's bad. That's bad. a U-turn on this. Like, the only positive part I had versus this Pokemon as a whole is that, um, well, or his team overall is that Ice Beam is definitely something he struggles with, so I think I'm not too bad off actually sending off Warren and see what it brings in afterwards. Stealth Rock should be the obvious play. That's not obvious. That's a bit unfortunate. Kind of great, this guy does not learn Toxic this generation. That would be just tremendously awful. Still, though, it should be able to carry Soul Stance and Earthquake, so... Stealth Rocks is fair enough. Wait, Stealth Rocks... And Substitute. Gotta have Earthquake, so let's see what the filler moves can be. Not gonna lie, did not expect that. Hmm. I'm not, like I said, overly weak towards the Gliscor in itself, but it does keep me at arm's length. I do force it out now, I hope. The question is, what, it does, it, what does it bring in? I know Lodius and Brelum do not want to deal with this at all. Which is nice. Let's see, he sends out... Alright, my lord, I remember. Can I get a freeze? Hey-o! I mean, maybe not. Oh, Jesus, is that the guy? Is that said? Oh, no. Um. Uh, he really can't do anything towards me, which is nice, but I really can't do anything to him either. <laughs> Good team. Do not enjoy it. Right? Dragon Tail. Oh! That works. Not. Hey! What do I think about this? I don't expect so, like, passive teams go and act against me, I really don't. Let's see, Earthquake, she really shouldn't do anything either. I just want my recovery back. <laughs> That's real about it. Because I want to bring him down to where... Or I want to keep... Keep him... I want him to keep attacking me, is what I'm trying to say. Um... Hopefully he doesn't go for Dragon Tail again. I'm I'm feeling I'm a sitting duck here. Please call again. Damn it. Oh hey oh 95% baby. That's what's up. Alright. I'm going for a sludge bomb on off chance he's switching Entei. Because I, I probably would do something like that. Who do we have here? Yes. Yes. Please do something. Oh, ho, 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 ho. That's a good damage. That's a good damage indeed. However, Sacred Fire is sacred, and that's not something I really want to deal with. Um, Singing Mirage. I mean, in theory, my only play is Defog in here. Trying to stomach whatever he can throw at me. Let's find out. Sacred Fire. Yeah. Took it kind of a right. There we go. Okay. I mean, a burn isn't really mattering all that much. 
I mean, it does suck. I mean, it's not that. Um, but since I'm not physically active, it doesn't. It, it's not as devastating as it could have been. Kind of surprised not to see it being choice banded though. Hmm. I can't expect then um, Liscor come back. All right, melodic. That works. You could do flowers. All right. Um, I mean, it should carry Ice Beam. Like, that's the thing. <laughs> I do not want to switch into this guy that easily. He could also recover here, which would be um, tremendously awful. I really don't have a way of actually beating it. Ugh. All right. I mean, if he goes for an ice beam, then so be it. That's my that's my mentality right now. If he goes for recover, I'd be infinitely more gladder, happier. Gladder is a thing. I get it. Okay, this time I'm actually gonna go for a Giga Drain or Energy Ball. I need the damage, even though he can mirror coat. Yes! He went for Dragon Tail, didn't he? Ice Beam! Oh! I knew I had it in him! Oh! <laughs> Took it like a champ! And he's in absolute range. I slept from here on off chance. I do have speed anyway, so it's, I'm not too worried where I am, but I still can gauge it, I think. Oh, I'm gonna do this with this one again. Hello! Momentum, baby! Where is my poison? Where is. <laughs> God damn it. Ah. <sighs> I mean, I do not want to take these sacred fires, that's for sure. Can I go for Draco versus... I mean, I should die to a combination of sacred fire and... Oh, fuck me, that's unfortunate for him. I hate to see it. I hate to see it. He has been very unlucky. I mean, missing Dragon Tail and Sacred Fire. I mean, those are 95% moves you don't usually see missing. I'll be honest and say that. Right? He does decide to stay in, right? No? What could he bring in? Well, alright, this guy. Is it my turn to miss? Not at all. Not at all. Nice. Not enough damage to really, like, scare it, but still good. You could do worse. I've already seen Substitute. It is whether or not... It is whether or not he has... Um, I'm actually gonna pull this off. Because I think he roost here. He has to roost. He has to have that move too. So substitute, roost... I only see him as a possible mono attacking in my book. Guillotine? Oh, buddy! Oh, that's new. That's new. Did not expect that. Guillotine, that's... Uh, <laughs> that's quite mighty. That's quite mighty indeed. So guillotine, substitute, stealth rocks. Well, I'm subbing myself then. <laughs> Fine. I can play that game too, buddy. Believe it or not. <laughs> Try to break me now, sucker. <laughs> okay, this is weird. I love it. 
<laughs> I don't believe guillotine can break my um I don't believe guillotine can break at all my um, substitute I hope at least it is whether or not he has something like Smackdown or anything like that but from the looks of it it really seems I am in a weird position I am I am in theory, I have no reason to really switch out, I think. As long as I can keep my sub up, that is. Plus, two quiver dances is not cutting for shit. Um, I feel like where is an art where, look what you made me do. <laughs> right, he withdraws? Like I said, I get that. Twente? Kangas gone. Alright. We're like 10 minutes in, so I only have so many opportunities of actually hurting this guy. Um, have expecting a fake out, right? Yeah. Shouldn't cripple me, but definitely break my sturdy. Or substitute. Or sturdy that too, I guess. Ain't happening, bro. Ain't happening. Right, resetting the sub. This is weird. He <laughs> couldn't be scrappy though, right? Or... I just want to see how much damage I do. Like around half, something like that. Stuff like that. Woke up and flinched. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Ain't happening, bro. Ain't happening. not bad this freaking butterfree is just doing doing stuff for me I love it and I still have like a oh. Oh. It's the, um, the sleep powder the sleep powder that's what we're gonna call it right now because I figure Entei comes in extreme speed and I can't take it out but I kind of want to resub right He must be thinking right now, like, what do I do against this anyway? Oh yeah, Rock Tomb. Don't believe, like, Bullet Seed shouldn't break. But it should be um, sashed, right? Flinch him! Yeah, Rock Tomb. Easiest play in the book. Mac Punch shouldn't hurt me a whole lot either. So it comes down to um, whether or not I can take an extreme speed from Entei, which I don't feel is possible. I am max HP, which is kind of weird, but that's what I'm getting at. I mean, if it's not possible, then so be it. For my book, I feel this is fine. <laughs> Unlimited power! Eat shit, bro. Eat shit. Oh. <laughs> That's why you're banded. That's why you're banned, that sucker. <laughs> Eat maggots. <laughs> you're not getting through me. 
Though in theory, Walrein did win this game right now, but we're, we're not taking that route. I have the high ground. <laughs> One turn of sleep, I only need two. Oh, come on! <laughs> yep, yeah. a body free sweep we got. Unfortunately, we couldn't keep it. That's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this game. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye. <laughs>